Monday, January the 16th, and today's my last excursion that I've actually planned for and booked for. Um, it's called the John Gray's tour. I've heard such amazing things about it. It's going to be a really long day, so I'm just prepping for that, to be honest. Um, my bag's already packed. I wear these shoes. These are a game changer. Listen, if you're ever doing um, activities, I would definitely say invest in some water shoes because they're a game changer. Mm -hmm. Mangrove tree. It grows in the water. Wow. Hi, nice to meet you again. Hello. <laughs> wow. Going in. Do you know how hard kayaking is? Jesus. I'm trying to get back to the boat. Alright, this is where the boat is. Yeah? Okay, I'm trying to get there. So let's see if I can do it, guys. I'll snap if I make it back to the boat. This is Kratong, that in Thai. Thai yeah. people call Kratong. Is, is so, it a celebration of nature? Yeah. Uh, yeah, they go. They're going to say like apologize to the water. Yeah. Or uh, thank you for water. What? Thank you for water. Yeah. Amen. So the first, the real day when when first full moon of November. That's a banana tree. Yeah. It's it's a lot of air, a lot of air bag, so it floats. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. 
And I said, what do you want me to do? I don't even want to go back to London. cleansing bad energy from your life and that's the reason why I really really wanted to come on this tour not just because of the amazing scenery and the kayaks and the caves but I really really wanted to come here because I really love this kind of spiritual element and like giving back and also just just feeling zen and just letting go of shit before I go back to the UK so super super excited to light this later and of course I will bring you along on that journey <laughs> so what do we do now, Wilson? Where are we going? Um, we dinner? We're going to be dinner we're here. Be dinner. And after that, we'll go one more out. Yeah, okay. To see what bioluminance Firefly in the water. Oh, sounds great. If you've made it this far, thank you for watching. Um, I thought to just do a cheeky little voiceover for the final part of this video because I was not able to record the rest of this incredible, incredible tour. I highly, highly, highly recommend it if you're ever in Phuket. Um, of course, I'll put all of the details in the description box below. Um, so as you can see, after dinner, we set sail back onto a 
onto the kayak. Um, the person I'm with was just a fellow solo traveler, so we decided to just share the kayak because we had to. <laughs> um, and so we set sail um, for the destination of a cave where we would see some luminescence um, light particles in the water. I mean, not really in the water, but the water is luminescent. So you could like put your hands in it, shake it all around and you just see light everywhere. Light particles all over my body. It was just, it was magical. And of course, because it had to be complete darkness to see the light. Um, of course, I couldn't use my camera. I couldn't use my phone. We couldn't use anything. So that was super, super, super incredible. And then we set sail to a lagoon where we got to, of course, light our loy kothongs, um, which we obviously took our time making earlier in the day. Um, and that's where I kind of gave my you know thanks to the nature and also you know asked for some you know spiritual healing spiritual cleansing and all of that jazz but it was absolutely incredible guys like i would 100 percent recommend this tour if you're ever in phuket the entire t entire trip was so well organized such an amazing informative team the food was just oh my god the food was so good the food was so good and i'm a foodie so if you're a foodie you will not be disappointed but yeah so i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you stay tuned for more of my vlogs and sit down chats and yeah thank you for watching bye